In this particular exercise, I'm going to show you how to select a subset of features from all of the features in a particular layer. We are working with the Southeastern New Brunswick Marketing Board's forest layer. Um, the particular subset of features from this that I wish to select are located in the northeastern portion of the limits. So I'll zoom in there once. And the area I'm more interested in is right up in here. I'm going to zoom in one more time. So it's this particular area that I want to select all the features in and none other. So what I'm going to do is use my polygon tool. Draw a polygon. So if you bring your mouse down here to the drawing GUI or drawing graphical user interface, you'll see a polygon tool. If a polygon tool is not showing on yours, click this down arrow and select it from the variety of tools that are contained. In my case, polygon tools has already been selected, so I'm going to click on it once and activate it. When it's activated, you'll get a set of crosshairs. Place the crosshairs on your view window, and then left-click your mouse button once, and you'll notice that I have not. I made sure that when I started, I did not touch any of the features. And I'll just continue to draw a polygon around the features that I want to select, and no others. Okay? So I have a polygon around them, and I am done drawing. So to escape the drawing of the polygon, I double-click once, and the polygon is created. However, you will notice that the polygon is filled in. Uh, we don't want that, so I'll right-click on the polygon. I'll left-click on Properties, and on the Symbol tab, under Fill Color, I'm going to change that to No Color, click Apply, and click OK. So now we have our polygon drawn. It does not touch any of the features anywhere, and the set of features that we want to select are contained with the polygon. So now we have to tell ArcMap to select them. So I'll do that by clicking on Selection, and then clicking on Select by Graphics. And you'll see that quickly those features are selected. Now, if I open up the Forest Attribute table by right-clicking on Forest and then left-clicking on open attribute table you will see the attribute table opened notice here at the bottom that 412 out of 92,506 features have been selected I only want to see the selected features so if I click the selected button the features that I've selected will show up here in blue scroll down through that and out of that there's 412 features selected and that is the end of this lesson.